I'm David from Sail Tahiti. Very happy to introduce you today to Tyrrell, uh, 2019 Sunry 50 Sailing Catamaran. The first one which had the innovative uh, electric engine technology. So she's a mix of uh, safety at sea, comfort, luxurious finish, and the most innovative uh, technology for uh, propulsion in a sailing catamaran. So on Tyrrell Helm Station, you've got uh, a big BNG uh, chart plotter, BNG uh, VHF, you've got the BNG autopilot. You've got all your lights here, search light, deck lights, uh, mass headlight. And uh, what's very special about Tyrrell is here or your throttle for the electric engine. So you can see you just move them with one figure. Uh, it's very light and you don't hear anything. So now you're trying to push the throttle. It's automatically in prison, in fact. Et là, tu vois effectivement le puissance que tu es en train d'envoyer. C'est en watts, en kilowatts, ouais. en temps réel. Quoi. Voilà, ouais, okay, ouais. très bien. Et bon, pareil pour la marche arrière, du coup. Oui, oui, oui. Et on n'entend que très peu, quoi. We've got a bow thruster here to make your harbor maneuvers easier. You can push one side or the other. Uh, and here is the remote control for the main cell traveler uh, that you have here at the helm station as well as next to the mast, uh, just underneath your winches for the mainsail sheets uh, and halyard. So if you're small like I am, um, you've got a foot rest uh, at the helm station, it's quite nice. And you actually have several positions on the helm seat. You can uh, raise that, which means you've got more space here if you need to uh, move around and be standing up, or you lower it to have it as a normal seat. You have a very large uh, seating and dining uh, area on uh, Tyrrell for uh, dining al fresco. You're protected by the rigid bibini, which also has some glass windows so you can see the star uh, and your sail when you're, uh, when you're sailing. Uh, and this very large table for uh, six to ten people is complemented by a wet bar with a sink, a fridge here, and some storage. So on the Frybridge, not only do you have the dining table, but you also have two very large sunbed. So it's a perfect place, again, to have your sun donors watching the sunset, or just enjoy the place while you're sailing, and you see all around from those two sunbeds. There's a gate between uh, the Frybridge and the stairs, so it's uh, very safe. And there's no risk of kids or elder people uh, falling. And the stairs are very wide with handrails, so again, it makes Thierry a very safe boat and you can have friends, even if they're not used to sailing, they will feel comfortable and safe on your boat. You then have uh, the very large uh, back cockpit, uh, which is fantastic for dining. You're protected uh, by the roof um, and you've got direct access to the sea. Um, sitting all around, you also have a sunbed from where you can watch the sea. These seats actually move and you can uh, install them wherever you want in the, in the cockpit. You've got a direct access to the swim platform, which turns into a beach club. So we have a, a big dinghy uh, with a 50 horsepower outboard, so perfect for uh, diving uh, expedition or just having fun with your kids uh, and very large scope so getting in the water is really easy you can lower the platform and get it just underneath the surface so making coming back to the boat very easy no matter what uh, equipment you have with you in the cockpit you also have a, a wet bar here um, with a sink large work surface for your cocktail and a freezer here. From the cockpit, you have direct access to the saloon with a very wide sliding door. And I will show you, you also have direct communication with the forward cockpit. It's got a very solid door which uh, opens uh, electrically, so it's very safe. Uh, 
and you get into the forward landing space. You've got your cocktail table here. Um, you also have the sun lounges um, and seatings for six people. So perfect area, especially at sunset. Uh, when you're watching the sea, it's the perfect place to have your, uh, your sun donut. The saloon is uh, one of my favorite places uh, on Tyrrell. Um, first, you've got a very large uh, dining and lounging area around that table with the sofa. Um, the table can go up and down electrically. Let me just show you. So you've got your remote here. Um, you can lower it to make a big uh, lounging area or coffee table, or you can uh, bring it up for dinner. This area is complemented uh, by the galley, which is really uh, one of a kind. Um, so you've got your Siemens uh, induction uh, stove, um, Siemens oven, so top quality uh, oven and uh, induction stove. You have here the sink with uh, the dishwasher, skier, storage. So you have storage for cooking really everywhere. Here, um, here as well. So you can have many, many pans, many um, plates and so on. You can really have a party with many friends. You've got your wine cooler here. Those beautiful uh, drawers for uh, your glasses. Uh, in the evening, it's really light uh, because it's backlit, so really beautiful. Um, here, you have a very large uh, fridge and freezer, so uh, plenty of space to store all your food for long passages uh, as well as entertaining. And again, it gives you direct access, so it's really one space uh, between the forward cockpit, the saloon, and the large cockpit aft. Tyrell's layout is uh, very versatile. It's perfect uh, if you have family and friends or if you want to run a charter business. So inside, you've got three very large double cabin with ensuite bathroom. There's also one cabin with bunk beds and ensuite bathroom. So perfect for kids, for example. And outside, there's one cabin which can be for your skipper or for the owner with ensuite bathroom as well, but very easy access to the cockpit and the flybridge. And then there's a proper uh, crew cabin on starboard aft. So that's really four cabin uh, for your guest, one cabin for the owner, uh, and one cabin for the crew.